Hi, I'm Brett from Pod. Today we'll be replacing the straps on a K-series set of braces. You can care for these, so we do encourage you to wash them. Like the padding, you can quite simply take all four of the straps off, wash the dirt, the mud, anything that may be uh, inhibiting or restricting that male and female Velcro to, to comfortably stick. But if you're to the point where the straps are truly thrashed, you've put in a lot of time on the bike, all the uh, elasticity is gone and they're not holding the brace in place, it's migrating a little bit, then it's time to replace the straps. We do highly recommend that as opposed to finishing your ride and throwing your braces straight into your gear bag, that you actually get the brace bag. So the brace bag keeps your braces clean apart from your helmet, your dirty boots, everything else. It also allows you to keep some spare parts. So whether you have the thicker hinge pads or if you have the hinge stops, anything, your old straps, new straps, you can keep them in that brace bag as well. When you finish riding, something else that we highly recommend is do your braces back up, thread the straps back through the loops and make sure that there's no male Velcro that can catch on anything in your gear bag or in your brace bag. So all four of your straps function identical. Once you've undone them all, I'll replace here today strap number one. Now the important thing to note, the straps are adjustable in length, meaning that the, the numbered component is what you adjust when you're putting the braces on and off. However, the opposing side of the strap can also be adjusted. So if you have a large calf, you'll probably want to loosen this side up. It's also got the, uh, the male, sorry, female Velcro on it. And now it's going to give you more adjustment um, and accommodate larger, obviously, calves as you move up into your thighs as well. So quite simply, undo the strap. From strap one and two, you can take off the strap pad and then we'll pull out the new strap because you've got four new straps in your packet. And in the exact same manner, just slip that on. Try to mirror the length that you had prior to that. Put that strap pad in place and you're ready to go. That's how simple it is to replace the straps on your K-Series brace. Log on to podactive.com if you'd like to look at any other videos for replacing any other components from your K-Series brace.